Greetings, everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Game Bros. I almost said unboxed. <laughs> Such a bad reflex. Anyway, so yeah, we were in the middle of the, uh, oh, fuck, where was it? The, the bonus round, and we were kind of forced to complete the level, so yeah, that's completed. So now we're going to go fight the boss of this area because we got all five. Nice. Now you may be noticing, something looks a little bit different here. So apparently they patched the PS1 game a bit. Just to make it look a little nicer. It was just a little patch, no big deal. So, that's probably why it looks like I'm no longer a blocky, weird, stretchy guy now, and... I practically look like a current-gen character. Isn't that weird, Jared? Yeah, yeah, but that is cool of them to go back and patch an old game. Yeah, right? And... Not, Naughty Dog was nice enough to do that. Yeah. I lied, that's not Naughty Dog who did that. <laughs> it was some other people. That's right, folks. We are out. We are playing... The Twin Sanity Edition. Mm-hmm. But oh, not Twin Sanity. What the? The Insane Trilogy. Oh, He's, yeah. Say hi to Tiger. Hi, Tiger. He's like, what, what, what? No! I hate you. Anyway, so yeah. They decided to remaster the original games, and I've been playing it for a little bit. And essentially, yeah, it's pretty much the same game. Nice. Except uh, now you have the... Uh... You're no longer, um, stuck using the D-pad. Whoops. Oh, oh yeah, no, the, that's the other benefit, is I can use analog stick if I want to. Yep. In some cases, I like to use the D-pad. Particularly this section. Yeah, grid sections like this, it's probably better, huh? Yeah. Woohoo! <laughs> but yeah, so I had to catch us up a little bit, because, well... Gotta get this version caught up to the let's play that we were doing. Ah! Oops, I zoned out. I'm sorry. <laughs> Matt, please. And we are carrying over the death counter, courtesy of AOJ, so thank you for that. And I will die many times in this game. Matter of fact, I've actually died quite a few times trying to catch us up. Also because I had to make sure to get some of the gems and all that that we were missing. Mm -hmm. Which, FYI, I ended up getting extra gems, so we have like six more than originally thought. But that is A-OK, -okay because look at it. It's beautiful. Yeah, you get to see all Crash Everyth doing his thing. Everything is so, you know, pristine and HD and... <laughs> oh, then, so uh... Close. That was unfortunate. Oh. We both fell. Yep. But yeah, no, <clears throat> we're playing on the PS4 and it looks fantastic. So I have to ask, considering his name is Tiny, was this a pun off of Tony the Tiger? Maybe. Tiny Tony the Tiger. Tiny the Tiger. Yep. Not so great in this <laughs> case. Nope. It's kind of a dick. Although kind of a I major think, dick. I think aside from Cortex, mm -hmm. he's like the only villain to appear in all three games. Oh yeah? Yeah, because I believe he appeared in the first one. Definitely in the second one, and he's the first boss in the third one. Mmm. Okay. So kind of like um, the small joke they did in Shantae where like a squid Ooh. baron always pops up and he's like constantly random uh, appearing boss status. Yeah, sure. I never heard of Shantae. I don't know what you're talking about. Sounds like a weird game. Actually, <laughs> it sounds pretty spectacular. But also weird. Yeah, I've never heard of Shantae, dude. Why are you asking me that? Anyway. So yeah, we're playing the Insanity Edition and so far... My criticisms say, it pretty much feels the same as the PS1. Mm. Like, he's just as janky, he's just as precise. His hitbox might be a little different. The only difference that we know of is when we're riding the little polar bear, he, uh, he has better control. Yeah. Because you saw my I death goodness. counter. Mm -hmm. I pretty much got hit up pretty bad. Anyway, so, also, we also accidentally did more than we planned. So, just a tad. So we're just going to check like out Hanging stages. Out real quick. Mm-hmm. And the other one, and then we're going to carry on. Oh, yeah. So, but just enjoy the prettiness that is uh, PS4. Look at Aku Aku and his leaf beard. Yes. That's the other issue, though, I do have with this game is that there's a lot of loading time. Mm. But for the amount of detail they put into the backgrounds, it kind of makes sense. Yeah. Load time's not too bad, but when you first load up the game... Mm-hmm. You gotta wait a little bit while you gotta select which game you wanna play before then that loads. Oh, yeah. 
They also got rid of the Howie scream, which makes me a little sad. Aw. But, that's okay. Sacrifices had to be made, Matt, to the entities of uh, updates. Right. <clears throat> With that said, though, <clears throat> looks like a lot of issues we were having also kind of got fixed, depending where they were. Yeah, there's like a few minor tweaks that this game has, but essentially it feels the same. Yeah. And they're not bad minor tweaks. Again, the fact that you can ride the polar bear now and it doesn't punish you horribly. Yeah, because the bear really slid around a yeah. lot. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, I remember when we recorded the, that episode and you were trying to do that section of it. Yeah. It took you like more than 10 times to like try and get close mm. to doing it. Yeah, it did. And then, you know, in the end, you weren't able to finish the challenge because it was just too much. It was. But this but... time around, Oops. when, whoops, Ow. this time around when you're catching us up, though, you did it in like three tries. Yeah, it didn't take a lot of tries. No, it didn't, which was great. Plus, I could tell just by watching that it was a lot easier to control. Yeah, it was. <clears throat> wasn't as super janky as it used to be. Even on the ice, I was a little bit more, uh... Yeah. In control. Yep. Of where I wanted to go, I wanna go left or right, I can do it! Hmm. Whoopsie daisy. Hmm. Hey. Cool. Hey, do that. Now... <laughs> Bombs. So they're totally, like, spiky fish, right? What, those? Yeah. Those are just spiky robots. I don't they know why, be. they look like spiky piranha fish. Oh, well, they could be. <clears throat> With jet butts or whatever those are supposed to be. Bubba butts! <laughs> yeah, I don't know, I think they're just supposed to be just spiky ball robots. Nothing fancy to them. <laughs> they kind of have the Mr. Zircon face too, a little yeah, bit. Yeah, a little bit. Mr. Yeah, this Zircon definitely, will destroy you now. There definitely is some, like, Ratchet and Clankisms in some of the designs here, but... Crash did technically come first, so maybe they were inspired by this. Who knows? True. Evil scientist robot or scientists. Yeah. They were the rage back then. They mm -hmm. were the perfect villains. <clears throat> yep. And I don't know if Cortex made us specifically, which, by the way, uh, I did boot up the first one on here, mm -hmm. and I've never really played the first one. Yeah. In the cutscenes. Well, not the cutscenes, but after the cutscenes, when you arrive on the island. Mm -hmm. If I didn't say so in the episode before, uh, mm -hmm. Wumpa fruits obviously are not a real thing. Uh -huh. But it turns out, I guess they got the name Wumpa because that was the name of the first island from the first level in Crash. Mm. So that's why they're called Wumpa fruits. Oh, okay. Also, a quick tip for y'all. Should be true in the other one. You can go down this hole to reach the secret level. Which will take you to a level that allows you to get a special gem. I already did that, so I'm not going to worry about that. Yay. And also, the crystal was over here, I think. Yes. Oh, look, it's a bunch of possums. Yeah, hey, possums. I don't need to do this, but I'll do it anyway. Bonus stage. Uh, yeah, bonus stage. Yeah. Bonus stage. I got a bonus Whee! stage to pick with you. <laughs> Woohoo! I was, trying to, I was really trying hard to think of like a clever joke with that. I, I'm, I'm coming oh, up with nothing. Oh, God damn it, Jared. You did it again. You didn't come up with the joke. Oh, no, the lack of what you didn't oh, do. Oh, God. You. Oh, uh, huh? I thought that killed you. Oh, no, I had an Aku. Oh. Okay, that would make sense why you didn't die. Um. um although I might be screwed. That might have. Yeah, that actually yep, might have. that screwed Yeah, me. that screwed you. Nah, whatever. I already got the gem here, so I'm not going to bother with this. All right. Kill the possum. No, 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 uh, no, no, no. The, the, the possum Sid, killed sorry. you. Sorry. So I think it's a rat. I don't know. It just looks rat like... in armor. Mm-hmm. Uh, no, God. Yeah, yeah, I did it. Mm -mm. I will say though, I don't know if it's because of the capture or something, but when I was catching us up, mm -hmm. I think there's a slight delay in our capture. Yeah, I could believe that. We had that problem with Mario. Which is weird though, because that's like an old game. Ow. And this is obviously PS4, so. Hmm. I don't know. Hmm. That's just. Uh, I don't know, man. I'll manage. 
Just like you managed in Mario 64, I'll manage. Yeah. Yep. Oh, no, no. oh I almost jumped on him. Woo! There we go. Nice. Good. You were too close. God damn it. Damn. Shh. <laughs> How? I slid. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> I meant to jump. From my perspective, it looked like you just, like, moved slight, like, walked forward and then died horribly. <laughs> I don't know. I guess as soon as I mentioned there's a delay, now I'm, like, fucking up like crazy. I'm like, oh. <laughs> like, left, right, left, right. Oh. A little bit of delay. Eh. Yeah, whatever. We'll fix them post. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just get through this. Oh. Oh, shit. Nice. Screw you, wheel. <laughs> got, Screw you, wheel. Oh, that was close. Anyway, so yeah, we got the gem already. And now we're moving on to the last stage of uh, Caught Up. Yes. Because, God, wait. I just realized, because... Okay, so part of the reason was is I think we had two episodes of the old ones still left, but mm -hmm. something happened to those. Yeah, we which, don't know what. Which means it took one episode to do one stage, and the last episode was like, we barely beat the next one here, and just effed up. I could believe that with how old uh, the original... When did the original come out again? Uh, I want to say 1997. The first one? Yeah. I want to say 1997. Alright, well, case in point, like, old game put on the PS3, and then the fact that it, uh, didn't even let you use the D-pad. I mean, it didn't, it only let you use the D-pad and didn't let Oops. you use the... Yeah, whatever. Oh, looks like we're speedrunning this then, huh? Yeah, which, by the way, folks, they actually added the Relic Run. Is in, that what this is called? Yeah, because in Crash 3, it's a requirement. Well, not a requirement per se, but... Mm. Kind of, they added it in the original third one. Oh, okay. So you can do the Relic Run. Does that give you anything extra for this one, then? Uh, no clue, but as far as I can tell, collect the crystals, collect the gems, and you get the true ending. Right. Whoa, okay. <clears throat> Which is what you told me. Oh, hey, buddy. Hey. <laughs> How you doing? I hate you. <laughs> those, uh... I actually don't remember those enemies from the original. Yeah, I remember them well. Because they always had that switch around goofy face. And I <laughs> loved it. Made me happy inside. I saw him put the Aku Aku so close to that. Yeah. Well, it's gotta be a challenge somehow. Mm-hmm. Oh shit. Eh. Eh. Ah! Nice. Good dodging. Also, I would be attacking those guys, but for some reason the hitbox in this version made it a little tighter and you could get hurt if you don't do it right. Yeah. So I'm just gonna ignore them for now. Eh, a wise strategy. Oh! Oh! oh my goodness. Wow. Ah! Those plants suck. Also, I've never been hit by those guys before, so I actually don't know what they really do. Maybe they just block your way and not hurt you? Who knows? Not right. sure. Hey, did I get the gem for this place? Uh... Well, That's not very specific. No. Well, I'm gonna assume I did. Okay. And if I didn't, oh well, I'll get it later. Yep. Hey, it's the death oh. run! Yeah! Yeah, why do, not? Yeah, do the death run. With the delay in the control? What could possibly go wrong?! Oh, there's some nitro right there. Oh, shit. Uh, um, uh, good job. I did it. Well, this is going to be interesting. Cool. Get those wump of fruits. Woo! Can I ignore you? Hey! Oh, Christ. Not the bees! The bees! I mean, at least you can hit it away. Ow. Yes. <laughs> oh, I got him. Okay, I almost got right. rambunctious there. A little bit. Come on. There we go. Fuck you and your exploding pellets of destiny. <laughs> pellets of destiny. Oh, what? What? Oh, right. There's a delay. I forgot. Hit. Oh, jeez. Oh, I went anime there for a second. A little bit. So now we know that Crash, you know, is uh, allergic. Yeah. No. Oh, yeah. Sure. Deathly allergic. Unless there's a bee out there that can make anyone puff up. I don't want to think about that. 
<laughs> well, tune in next time, folks, when I go down this death pass to destiny here on the Insane Trilogy Twin Sanity Crash Course uh, Tag Team. Uh, yeah, that one. To be continued, everybody. Oh.